Hello there, my name is Ismaus and uh, today we're going to be looking at something different. We're going to be looking or talking about different artworks from the community. Yeah, so I'm starting with this. It's a very, very interesting artwork it's from uh, Maisen Hussein. Uh, yeah, just look at this. Uh, for all the time I've been using Blender, I can't really t start telling you how this was done. It's quite amazing. For, at first I thought uh, maybe it was uh, just a cube uh, with, uh, with different textures uh, that are kind of using projection mapping uh, with uh, using another object because when you use projection mapping uh, the the texture usually stays in the same position but uh, then there is this occlusion uh, that is happening every time it changes to a different face so I thought maybe he was using uh, different materials for different faces uh, so that uh, that occlusion just happens uh, naturally uh, because you can even see I think he, he did use uh, some text uh, um, object coordinate mapping because I can see that empty there it would be maybe it's what he's using to kind of uh, do that projection mapping for the images but uh, you can see some depth within the images that's what is confusing me uh, quite a lot uh, so yes yeah, a very interesting artwork uh, this one was from Abdul I'm, I'm not sure how to pronounce that but uh, uh, it's also interesting so I don't think uh, in the way he's, uh, how, he says he's, he used the, uh, he just used a cube and a what? And a sunlight uh, to create this effect, but I don't think that would be very possible. That would be possible using Blender 2.8 or any previous versions uh, because, because of how those, uh, the, because of how uh, that, uh, the twist in the, fo in the, in the clouds that you see there i don't think you can use nodes uh, to achieve that so if he did that if he just used a cube and a sunlight he must have used uh the new blender no animation nodes or i don't they, are they called animation nodes there are little branches uh that have been put up uh there is animation nodes there is a uh, blend uh, functions branch so i think that's that's that would only be possible with those branches but uh, in the current uh, official uh, release it shouldn't be i don't think it's possible uh this is uh, this in this version here uh, the one we're looking at here i think uh, this mice and hussein again the same guy i think this one he used a projection mapping since there isn't that much occ occlusion yeah, I added this in because I also found it very interesting. Uh, he just made a cube without, sorry, he rendered a sphere without using any geometry, spherical geometry. Uh, this is from Eris Snail, uh, just doing some procedure, uh, yeah, doing some procedure artwork. Yeah, I'm not sure if, uh, I'm seeing a lot of nodes here, so. Yeah, if you tried doing this and you walked away for a minute or two, I don't think you would remember what you were doing uh, by the time you come back. But uh, it's quite interesting. So I'm also not sure if they're using uh, Blender 2.8 or they're using uh, the nodes, uh, the animation nodes uh, branch or functions branch. Uh, because some of the things they're doing here would be quite hard to do using just uh, the current version, the official release that, ha that that doesn't have the animation nodes or functions nodes. Uh, this is definitely animation nodes, as you can see from the from the uh, tag there. Yeah, so the coming versions of Blender are going to be quite interesting. I've tried playing around with uh, the function nodes, and I can tell you there's a lot of things. Uh, that we we're going to be able to do uh, that we haven't been do that we are really hard to do in uh, the current state of blender uh, this is a just painting a painting shader i'm not even sure how we did this but i found it very interesting quite quite interesting that's it uh, thank you for watching uh hopefully you find this interesting and uh, i'll be trying to do some of these uh videos like this uh, just to see how they go